Go. All right, we are learning the heart course today. We're going to teach you guys all about how blood flows in and out of the heart. I'm going to start right here at the entrance door of the heart. Do you know what the entrance door of the heart is called? Yes. What's it called? The vena cava. I think I heard part of it. Like the vena cava is the entrance door. Everybody say vena cava. Vena cava. Very good. When it's your turn at the vena cava, you're going to walk through the vena cava. Wait until you get all the way near the front. And when you get near the front, you're going to pick up a scooter. Now, notice this scooter is what color? Blue. Blue. Blue in the heart represents what? Out of Good. You are running out of oxygen. You're almost out. So you're in the top part of the heart called the right atrium. Atrium. It's right here on the wall for us. Right atrium. And what color are we? Blue. Blue wine? Because we're out of oxygen. Good. You're out of oxygen. So hold your scooter in your hand. Wait your turn until it's your turn to go under. We'll get one ball for yourself. Once you have one ball and one scooter, go all the way under the bow. Class, what is the bow? The where the where the where it lets the blood go in and out. Good. It's a gate that opens and closes. So just like this tunnel here, it's going to open and let me through, but we don't want to go backwards. So I go all the way through the bow, and I find myself where? At the right ventricle. Very good. The right ventricle. The ventricle is what part of the heart? The bottom part of the heart. Right now we're on the right side of the What color? Blue. Blue. So now I've gone through the valve. I'm in the right ventricle. I'm going to sit down on my scooter, keep my ball on my lap, and I'm just going to simply zigzag back and forth through the cone. Right? You can see there's arrows in the ground to help you out. Zigging and zagging back and forth. And this represents the liquid, the last bit of oxygen. You're almost out of oxygen. So I'm going to find myself at one more of these things. What is this thing called? Oh. A valve. A valve is a what? Okay. Good. It's a gate that opens and closes. So it opens and lets me through, and it closes behind me because I can't go backwards. I'm going to turn the corner here, and then I find myself at what is called the pulmonary. Pulmonary has to do with your what? Lungs. Thank you. So when you hear the word pulmonary, I want you to think of lungs. Very good. So we just went through the pulmonary valve, and I found myself right here at the pulmonary, and I'm going to pulmonary, and not really pull, just kind of walk your hand, but pretend like you're pulling as you have your blood cell in your lap, and you're going to walk your hands all the way down. What is this blue thing called? Pulmonary. What is it called? Pulmonary. Pulmonary. Very good. So I get all the way right here. There's a big red sign. What does it say? Stop. Stop. Very good. You can just simply follow the instructions. Stop. You will stand up, pick up your scooter and your blood cell. Then you're going to take your blue, your scooter and your blood cell. Put the blue down. Then put the scooter on the mat. Try to put the scooter up towards the front of your stomach. In the way, just put as close as you can towards the front of the mat. Then I'm going to continue. Now, pulmonary should lead me to the what? To the lungs. Pulmonary means lungs. lungs. Let's try that again. Pulmonary means lungs. lungs. So after I finish the pulmonary, the last second, last ounce of oxygen I have, put my equipment up, and I'm running out almost completely out of oxygen, so I must go to the lungs. lungs. Our lungs are right here. You can see the pathway leads you here. All the way to the lungs. Right here at the lungs, it tells you exactly what you need to do. Lungs, you start with 10 jumping jacks, then you do ABC scissors, then you do 10 jump ropes. That's, or sorry, 20 jump ropes. That's imaginary jump ropes like that. Once you have finished all of those, that, 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 then you have lots of what? Oxygen. Oxygen. And once you have lots of oxygen, what color do you turn? Red. Red, a bright red, in fact. So you'll get a bright red ball, but make sure go to the lungs to get oxygen first so that you can turn a bright red. Now, once I turn a bright red, I come back into the heart. And once I come back into the heart, I'm on what part of the heart? The left atrium. What color is the left atrium? Red. Red. Why is it red, class? Because you have oxygen. Full of oxygen. Good, because we're full of oxygen. So, now I enter back into the heart because I left to go to the lungs. Got oxygen from the lungs. I'm going back into the heart. And I come through another what? Valve. Valve. Valve is what? 
I gave it open to close it, and then you have lots of oxygen. You're gonna jump over, wee, and jump over, wee, but oh, oh, I have some blockage here. What is this white blockage that is building up here? That's right, cholesterol. We learned about cholesterol that it's a fatty buildup. It's that gunky, junky stuff that blocks blood from going through. So just like cholesterol blocks it in our real body, it's going to slow us down as we go through the heart machine. Take the ball, put it between your two knees, and you're going to walk, or you can jump, and it's a zigzag motion around all of the cholesterol. Now we find cholesterol in foods like what? Pizza, donuts, donuts, donuts. Good, pizza, donuts. We have french fries, hamburgers, those things that are greasy and fried and full of sodium, <laughs> salt, full of sugary stuff, and that builds up that block. So we have to slow down as we jump with the ball between our knees all the way until we get to another one of these things. What are those called? A valve. A valve is a what? Very good. You guys are catching on. This is called the aortic valve, and the aortic valve leads to this big, huge tunnel right here. Do you know the name of the exit door of the heart? What's it called? It's called what? Aorta. That's right. The aorta is a huge tunnel that is the exit door of the heart. So you are going to crawl through the exit door of the heart. And then I find myself going two different pathways. One way is to the brain. One way is to the body. Now, if I, uh, the person ahead of me goes one way, I need to go the opposite way. So let's say the person ahead of me went to the brain to deliver oxygen over there. Where should I go? To the body. To the body. Now what's going to happen is, if you go through the body, you're going to go out this door right here. You're going to just jog right here on the blacktop, around the blacktop, around the blacktop. You come in that doorway over there. All right? That's if you're going to the body. So you go all the way outside. Jog on the right, down by the way the basketball goal is, turn back, come in that door. Now let's say the person ahead of me went to the body. Where should I go? To the brain. To the brain. So I'm just crawling through the tunnel. Alright. So now in the brain, we're going to actually use our brain. And then all along the walls here, right here, right here, right here, right here, right here are all questions about the heart. We want you to post one of those papers. It doesn't matter which. You put several so that um, you would be all clogged up. We don't want our blood clock in one place. You would go to the question and you try to ask yourself without reading the answer choices. If you go to one that has the calendar, the answer choices are right there. So try to cover them up before you see the answer. I want you to ask yourself one of the questions and see if you can figure out the answer. On the calendar ones, it's the one that is in bold. But there's another answer choice. Um, that has the answer under it. So that will help you out. So you can kind of just be like, all right, let's ask for stuff number four. I read number four and I think about it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I think it's this. And then I can just turn it up this way and check it out. All right? Now, once I answer one or two questions, I'm going to continue this way. And this is representing me delivering oxygen all to the brain. So I just have to ask one of those questions. But delivering the oxygen to the brain. I will meet up with these people who are coming from the body, and we are going to drop off our red ball. Why are we giving away our red ball? Because we're out of oxygen. Very good, because we're out of oxygen. We just delivered it all to the body. We just delivered it all to the brain, and now we're running out, so we're going to have to come back to the heart. We come back to the heart on veins, right? That's the tunnels, the tunnels, pathways that we're traveling, are the veins leading us back to the heart. And once we're back at the heart, we're almost out of oxygen, so what color are you here? Blue, and then you will start the process all over again. You see, our heart is a cycle. It's part of the circulatory system that is circulating, cycle, blood through the body. It goes all through the body, the tunnels, those are called blood vessels, the arteries and things. They travel all throughout our body, circulating. It goes from the heart, all through our blood vessels, down all the way to our toes, fingers, brain, back to our heart, and the process continues over again. So for you, the process will still continue. You'll go from the top part of the heart, right atrium, get your materials, go down through the valve to the right ventricle, through another valve, and then you'll go down the pulmonary. Once you go down the pulmonary, you need to head out of the heart to the... Blood. 
lungs. If the lungs to pick up oxygen. Once you pick up oxygen, what color do you turn? Red. Bright red. You get in the bright red and you go through that other channel thing called the what? A valve. A valve. Yeah. You have lots of oxygen. You're going to jump over, jump over, jump over, and up. And you find yourself at the white over there. What is that white stuff called? Cholesterol. Cholesterol. It slows our blood down. Continue through the cholesterol and you find yourself at the exit door of the heart called the? Aorta. Aorta. From the aorta, there's two pathways. The person ahead of you goes one way, you go the opposite direction and uh, deliver the oxygen in that van. And you'll continue, 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 just like blood does and it never stops.